Hey everyone, welcome to Simply Learn's YouTube channel. In this session, we will discuss the top coding books. But before we begin, make sure that you have subscribed to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit that bell icon to never miss an update from Simply Learn. If you are a coder, then you should be a good reader. It helps you enhance your coding skills based on the current trends. Before getting started with code, a coder should understand the requirements. The right books will help you enrich your programming and debugging skills. So, we bring you a list of books, each with a different perspective that will help you gain an overall expertise in the field of coding. So, without further ado, let's get started with our first coding book in this session. So, the first book in our docket is Automate the Boring Stuff with Python. This book was written by a great author, Mr. Swagat, and published in the year 2015. Swagat is a software developer and also a passionate tech author. He loves to develop codes in Python, so he used Python language in this book. In this book, you will learn how to use Python for writing programs, which is mainly for beginner level programmers. It will help you in learning and creating programs using Python. This helps you to get the knowledge on automating the keyboard and mouse and web scraping. This book also helps in split merging encryption of PDFs. Now, why should you go for it? The author of this book mentioned a step-by-step -step explanation for each and every program that makes learning curve linear and you can get started with your coding like icing on the top of cake. This book is completely for beginners, so no hardcore coding knowledge is required. And also, to advance to the next level, this book helps you with some practice programs. There are practice questions at the end of each chapter to get more ideas about Python and improve the programming skills. These are the few reasons to make you choose this book for learning to code. Next in the docket is Clean Code, a handbook of agile and craftsmanship. This book was written by a great author, Robert Martin. This book will help you plot that next breakthrough to become a professional programmer. This book was published in the year 2008 and it is suitable for software developers, team lead, project managers to produce better code. This book is divided into three parts. The first part describes the principles, patterns and writing clean code. The second part describes several case studies with exercises. The third part will walk you through a single chapter containing a list of heuristics. This book gives an idea for coders to know all the minute and delicate differences between a good and a bad code. This book also improves the state of craftsmanship and fixing the bugs in the code. Why should one go for it? The author Robert Martin used proper code and neat explanations for each and every code to make it easy for everyone to understand how codes are written. Robert also explained how to transform and create names, classes, functions and error handling. Challenges are provided at the end of every chapter to make it easy for every reader to implement codes in real time. If you're interested in producing better code, this book is the best choice for you. Moving up to the next book, we have Programming Pearls. Programming Pearls was written by Joe Bentley. The Programming Pearls offers unique solutions to nagging problems. This book was published in the year 1986. This book offers solid techniques and solutions to computer programs. In this book, Bentley mainly focused on three essays. Testing, bugging and timing, set representation, string problems. This book is covered with practical problems and effective solutions. The main highlight of this book is delightful reading and the writing style is simply outstanding. Now, why should you go for it? In this book, Bentley mainly focused on hardcore coding problems to deliver workable solutions for the coders and programmers. It challenges the outstanding concepts of CPU, memory and algorithms. Bentley focused on principles and key techniques for easy understanding for the readers. The next book in the session is The Clean Coder, a coder of conduct for professional programmers. Much more than the rules and guidelines, which was written by the author Robert Martin, is published in the year 2011. 
This book covers tools and techniques for true software craftsmanship. The key factor of this book is practical advice on refactoring and testing. Now, why should one go for it? Through this book, Martin shows how to approach software development with honor, self-respect and pride. And also, this book demonstrates avoiding common pitfalls in software development. Now moving forward, the next book of the session is Code Complete, a practical handbook of software construction. This book was written by Steve McConnell and published in the year 1993. He is the author of multiple software engineering books and an expert in software development and project management. It is fully loaded with integration architecture, testing and leading edge coding concepts of software development. Now, why should one go for this book? This book is a massive piece of literature packed with techniques and suggestions to improve everyday programming. Steve covered this book with big projects to make it easy for everyone to improve coding skills. Now the next book in the list is The Art of Computer Programming which was written by the author Donald Nutt. This book was published in the year 1968 with four volumes. It is a computer monograph that covers many kinds of programming algorithms and their analysis. This book mainly covers and represents the inside concepts of a computer. The key concepts of this book are programming algorithms, fundamental algorithms, sorting and searching. Now why should one go for this book? This book mainly covers the chief technical aspects of the algorithms and their analysis. Every chapter of this book is explained with clean code and flowcharts that is easy for every reader to understand. Now the next book in the session is Zero Bucks and Program Faster which was written by the author Kate Thompson. Kate Thompson is also known for being the best writers of the children's novels. She has spent two years of research and find out the techniques of bug avoidance. This book was published in August 2015. This book gives an idea of improving skills and avoiding mistakes in coding. In this book, Kate mainly concentrated on bug avoidance techniques and implementing the secure code, improving skills and principles to avoid bugs. Now why should one go for this book? This book helps to write code in a secure way that improves the security of the code and it helps to improve the coding time by reducing the effort with fewer bugs. Now moving forward, the next book is Introduction to Algorithms. This book was written by the author Thompson Common and published in the year 1989. This book provides a comprehensive introduction to modern study of computer algorithms. It represents many algorithms and covers them in considerable depth and makes their design and analysis accessible to all levels of readers. Some of the key features of this book are pseudocode, arithmetic algorithms and arithmetic circuits. Now, why should one go for this book? Each chapter of this book presents an algorithm, a design technique and an application area or a related topic. Algorithms are described in English and in a pseudocode designed to be readable by anyone who has done a little programming. This book also covers the depth of greedy algorithms and mathematical rigor. The next book in the list is Rapid Development, Taming Wild Software Schedules. This book is written by Steve McConnell. This book was published in the year 1996 and this book helps in improving the development speed of rapid development and risk management and also prototyping. Now, why should one go for this book? This book is completely designed with an overview of the projects and their directions, which helps in avoiding the mistakes for rapid development, including creeping requirements, short changed quality and silver bullet syndrome. Moving forward, the final book of this session is Hacking, The Art of Exploration, 2nd edition. This book was written by John Erickson and was published in the year 2008. This book is totally filled with real code and hacking techniques. This book helps in providing the art of creative problem solving tricks and techniques on hacking and shell scripts. Now why should you go for this book? This book helps for the readers who are interested in understanding exploits and exploits development. This book also is helpful for the readers who are finding solutions for complex problems. And with that, we have come to an end of this session. I hope this session gave you a list of the best books that you are waiting for. If you have any queries regarding the 
books discussed in this session, then please feel free to let us know in the comment sections below. Our team of experts will be happy to resolve all your queries. Until next time, thank you, stay safe and keep learning. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.